<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Tom White. Presenting the Hall of Fame ring tonight to Tom White is K&N Engineering co-founder and Hall of Fame member, Norm McDonald. Tom White, for your role as co-founder of White Brothers Cycle Specialties, as creator of the World Vet MX Championship and the World Four Stroke Championship, as founder of the Early Years of Motocross Museum, and for your continuing philanthropic role in the promotion of motorcycling, it is my great honor to induct you into the AMA Motorcycle Hall of Fame. Thank you, Perry, and thank you, AMA friends, AIM Expo visitors, ladies and gentlemen. I've had a lot of good fortune in my life, and as the video showed, some major challenges. In life, we must deal with the good and the bad, and trust the Lord that we will somehow come out better. When bad things happen, we sometimes ask, why me? It should be the same when we really good things happen. Why me? How does a kid that couldn't even make it around the block on a Honda 50 without hitting a parked Cadillac end up in the Motorcycle <laughs> Hall of Fame? I'm not sure, but I know how it makes me feel. I want to dance, jump for joy, hug every friend that helped me along the path, and I want to ride my motorcycle. Well, my motorcycles, as I have a few. I want to cry and pray with lots of thanks to give to my parents, for paying to fix the friend's Honda 50 and still allow me to buy a motorcycle. I want to thank my wife, Danny, and my children, Kristen, Brad, and Michael, who paid the price while I was trying to build a future. There is no higher honor in motorcycling that is more important than being inducted into the AMA Motorcycle Hall of Fame. This is special for me because it comes from my peers in the industry and existing Hall of Famers. I'm humbled to think that my heroes, these great people of the sport, believe that I'm worthy of this acknowledgement of my life and career. AMA friends, I can't thank you enough. And Chet Burks, I sincerely thank you for capturing my motorcycle life on video. My inclusion is a real testimony that if you love motorcycling enough, sooner or later someone will notice. That person was my friend Don Rosine and I want to thank him for submitting an application to the Motorcycle Hall of Fame on my behalf. I'd like to congratulate my friends and fellow inductees, Pierre Carsmakers, Scott Summers, Byron Hines, Mike LaRocco, Rob Muzzy, and George Barber for receiving this acknowledgement of their contribution to motorcycling. Willie G, my tribute to you is being the proud owner of 11 Harley Davidsons. <laughs> See what your family started? My way of celebrating this honor was to reach out to the people most responsible for mentoring me, pushing me, supporting me, and reminding me what is most important. Most have joined me this weekend. We had a private banquet where I was able to tell each one how important they are to me, and tonight they are sitting up front in the TW section, and I'd like to acknowledge each individual. I'd like to thank my friend Brian Farnsworth for showing me how to race, how to make the bike work, and how to have fun in life. I'd like to thank Bob Maynard for teaching me the motorcycle business during the six years I worked for him at Orange County Cycle. We all need a doctor friend, and that is my friend, Dr. Kerry Tanner. In our early years, he ported my cylinder heads, and now he tries to help my aging body stay in the game. I'd like to thank Jody Weissel for his support, direction, and friendship over nearly 40 years. I'd also like to thank the Coombs family for their stewardship of motocross over the years. I'd like to thank my brother Dan, for it was White Brothers. White Brothers was over 25 years of my life, and the most important is our partners are here with me. John Bowie was the man that counted the beans and made sure there were a few left at the end of every day. 
Sherry Ridenauer was our marketing and catalog person. Many still say the WB catalog was the most fun catalog in the business, and she was the one that was responsible. Sherry is an amazing woman, and I'm proud to call her my friend. I'd like to thank my friend Alan Olson. We have been close for nearly 40 years as racers, friends, workers, and golf partners. He always seems to come out on top when we race or play golf, but that has pushed me. And he was an amazing partner in White Brothers Manufacturing and our race teams. Glenn Helen has been my home away from home for years, and I'd like to thank Lori Bryant, Richard Stalke, and Frank and Myra Thomason. This has been the best job of my life, and it has never involved a paycheck, as what I get from the association is way better. I want to thank my friend Arnie Ackerman and MAG for allowing me to move to the next phase of my life and keeping me involved in the motorcycle industry. The recent merger with Tucker Rocky is exciting, and the group will be leading the way to grow this industry, as will the AMA. Most important to me is my family, and I am so proud of my daughter Kristen and her husband John for all the years at White Brothers and now the success they enjoy at WUSA. My son Michael has just taken my same passion in motorcycling into bicycle journalism and just two months ago married the love of his life, Parisa. But far the most important, I'd like to thank my beautiful wife, Danny, for 38 years of love, commitment, and trust. I fell in love with her beauty when I first met her, yet she gets more beautiful every day inside and outside. In closing, I'd like to acknowledge the real Hall of Famer in the White family, and that is my son, Brad. His love of life and willingness to fight through sickness, disabilities, and pain has inspired me to be the best I can be. Brad, this one's for you. Yeah.